hey guys welcome back to clarity chart analysis and in this video i'll be using market structure to tell us our coins position of the chain link on the price market chart and also using market structure to predict the next possible move of chain link but first guys if you're new to this channel and you want to make money on both direction of the market you want to know our current position on the price market chart this channel is for you please subscribe like and put on the notification to be notified anytime i drop a new video so guys the most recent break of structure we saw on our daily structure was a break of structure to the downside and guys remember that after every break of structure we expected a pullback for us to be on the pullback phase guys we need price to take out this swing that give us this lower low on our daily time frame and guys we've seen price traded above it telling us that now we are now back to a pullback phase and guys currently price actually came close to the upper swing of our daily time frame but price did not take it out so we are still on a bearish trend and we even seen price gone down so guys currently now we're trading between this upper swing and this lower swing of our daily time frame guys remember that market structure is king and with market structure you can actually trade, trade both direction of the market you can make money trading both direction of the market what you just need to do is you just need to trade alongside with market structure if market structure is bullish on daily time frame bullish on four hour time frame and bullish on one hour time frame at that moment that shows our price is bullish but if market structure is bearish on daily time frame and bearish on four hour time frame bearish on one hour time frame that shows at that moment market structure is bearish so guys trade carefully and not lose your add M money back to the market and that's why clarity chart analysis is here to give you update on market structure so guys We'll be going back to our far time frame to go see what price is doing on our far time frame and what are we expecting to see guys on our far time frame if we are still on a pullback phase on our daily time frame we expect to be on a bullish trend but immediately price change back to a bearish trend then we should know that price has resumed back the impulsive phase of our daily time frame which is a bearish trend so guys coming back to our far time frame it was this swing this same swing that gave us this lower low and guys we've seen price traded above with price pullback telling us that now we're on a bullish trend which is an impulse a pullback phase on our daily time frame so guys immediately expecting more break of structure to the upside we saw a break of structure to the downside telling us that now price is now back to a bearish trend and what does it mean price being on a bearish trend on our far time frame means that price has resumed back the impulsive phase of our daily time frame which is a bearish trend so guys let's trade carefully let's not lose our added money back to the market on our far time frame now we are on a bearish trend on our daily time frame we're also on a bearish trend and guys after this break of structure to the downside for us to be on a pullback phase guys we need price to take out this swing that give us this lower low guys if price is not taking out this swing that give us this lower low then we should not be surprised that we'll continue seeing more break of structure to the downside and for us to be on the bullish trend on our far time frame we need price to take out this swing this upper swing of our far time frame so guys let's go back to a one hour time frame let's go see if we can source for more information about market structure and guys on our one hour time frame it was this swing that gave us this lower low so guys we just need to wait and see what price is doing and if you notice price has just been giving us a range for a period of time it broke structure to the upside and before knowing it we saw another broke of structure back to the downside so guys do you think price is going to take out the lower swing or the upper swing is it possible for us to see price rally back up and take out this upper swing guys let's just trade carefully let's not lose our added money back to the market remember that our daily time frame is on a bearish trend expecting a pullback we've seen a pullback and now price has now gone back to an impulsive phase our far time frame was giving us a bullish trend to show that we are on a pullback phase on our daily time frame but now price is now back to a bearish trend telling us that we are done with the pullback phase and we're now back to an impulsive phase on our daily time frame why our, our one hour time frame for us to be on the pullback phase for our four hour time frame we expect to see a bullish trend on our one hour time frame and guys we're still on the bearish trend that shows all four time frames all three time frames are on a bearish trend so guys trade carefully and don't lose your added money back to the market trade alongside with market structure that's why it's that's why clarity chart analysis is there to give you updates on market structure but guys for you not to miss out please subscribe like and put on the notification to be notified anytime i drop a new video thank you guys for watching this video